there, everybody. This is G Maynard here, and welcome to G Maynard Plays Sonic the Hedgehog. The first game to introduce the world to the Blue Blur. It is a fast-paced platformer debuting on the Sega Genesis in 1991. It has a relatively simple plot. Um, I'm not playing at the moment. This is just a demo here showcasing the game. Um, anyways, um, the plot is relatively simple. Um, basically, the story is that an evil scientist known as Dr. Robotnik, or as the Japanese versions and later version and later installments of the series call him Dr. Eggman, is capturing different animals and turning them into robots known as Badniks. And that is basically the main story here, so let's get started, shall we? Alright, first off with our first stage, Green Hill Zone Act 1. It's a relatively simple stage. And this here's a monitor containing ten rings. That's a motor bug right there. That's a bad nick. And that there is a uh, buzz bomber. And apparently there's spring in that tree. Well, and those there are choppers. Those are another type of bad nick. And as you see, I'm collecting rings here. They. Oh. Yeah. Basically, rings protect you. Basically, if you have at least one ring, you'll manage to sustain taking hit at the cost of losing all your other rings. And that was a crab meat there. Alright, taking out these buzz bombers here. Gonna jump on this. Or not. I guess we're not jumping on that spring. Alright, you'll jump on that spring though. Alright, gotta avoid these spikes. Alright, it has some monitors containing some rings, and we have a, um, mod here that contains invincibility. In other words, we can just, well, need to gain some speed first, um, to get through this loop. Um, anyways, um, we are currently, basically, nothing can hurt us at the moment. Here. Let's see. Oh. Looks like we got some rash. And here we are at the end. And there's that giant ring there. And we have past act one. That's our score right there. Um, time bonus and ring bonus added. And we are now off to the bonus stage. Basically, um, Sonic is currently in his spin dash form. And the only way to, and um, we can jump sometime, and our only functions here are to jump, and this maze here with this psychedelic background here, um, continuously rotates, and, and um, there are two ways to end this stick end this. Um, normally I threw this a bit faster, but as I mentioned in my other two let's plays. Um playing the game and commentating it at the same time. You know, playing properly and commenting at the same time is hard. Well, anyways, um, something I should also notify is that, um, well, besides that, oh, oh, yep, and there's the goal. Well, there's another way to, um, clear the bonus stage, but we'll 
get to that when we get there. Okay. Alright, that rock's not part of the background. Alright, this could be down to Act 2. Anyways, if you want to get to activate that, um, big ring, you'll need to collect at least 50 rings before the end of the level. Okay, going on that swinging platform, taking out three choppers in a row, and through a loop. Okay, ah, and we knock down a monitor, which also contains invincibility. And we're gonna do some platform jumping here. And a goal post there. Well, this is primarily a checkpoint. Basically, if you lose a life, you'll restart at that checkpoint. Alright, and. Alright, we made it into the bonus stage this again. I should point out that the bonus stage this time will have a different layout. Alright. Alright, some other things I should point out. Um, the R circles will change the rotation of the maze. The ups and downs will change the speed of how fast it rotates. I think that's ain't meant only if you're, um... Oh. You know, that's mainly... Oh. Okay, we got through here. Okay, as I was saying, that's probably if you're... On. Alright, and... Anyways, here's some... Colored squares here. As he hits them, they'll disappear. Alright. And in the middle right there is this thing called a... Chaos Emerald. It's basically a MacGuffin. And, um... Alright, let's see if I can try. I think I might be able to get... I don't know. Oh. Oh, oh! Oh, that's a good jingle, though. Because with um, this ring collecting here in this bonus day, if you collect at least. Well, I'll show you when um, I finish. Alright, let's see. Can we get it? Can we get it? Nope, 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 nope. Alright. We're, we're, we're getting there. We'll get there eventually. Oh, 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 can't, can't. Oh, 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 oh. Oh dear, oh dear, okay. Oh, oh. Try and get it. Let's see. Oh. Uh. Uh, let's see. Give me, 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 Getting 50 rings in a bonus stage got us a continue. Basically, a continue will allow us to continue from where we left off. Um, after we, um, if we lose our lives. Um, that is right. Anyways, I have access to a barrier which will protect us for a hit without having to being any rings lost. Let's see what's up here. Oh. Oh well. 
Anyways, let's continue on here. And have to jump there because if you as you see here I'm pausing here. There's a um spring ink pad here that'll bring us shoot us back the other way. Alright, now let's continue. And let's try and cross no, we're we're not gonna cross it properly, I guess. Well, Alright, take out these chameleon looking dudes, I forget their name. Alright, hop on this platform here, and let's continue on. Oh! Oh! Alright, I should also point out that spikes here, um, if you land on them, um, they do not and if you hit them Basically, will ignore your, um... Oh! Ah, yeah. oh, not again! Basically, what I'm saying is like spikes basically ignore the concept of um, mercy invincibility, or in other words, the amount of time you're safe from being hit. All right, let's jump on this platform. Checkpoint and why? It's Dr. Robotnik, and he's gonna attack us with this wrecking ball. All right. Anyways, um, well, he's dead already. Basically. It's a relatively simple fight. Just avoid the, um... I don't know what I'm saying. Oh, just avoid the, uh... Good thing we can pause anytime. Um, okay. Just avoid the Wrecking Ball. Hit him about eight times. Then you're done. And we just... Hit this capsule, which releases some of... Some animal friends here. And... We passed Act 3. And are heading on to... Our next zone. Which is the Marble Zone. Alright. Primarily has an ancient ruins theme here. Oh, and there's lava. Alright. Man, that there was a caterkiller. There. Uh, you typically a pain to dispose of. Alright, gotta avoid the fire stuff here. Oh. And here's a secret area here, which contains, um, containers, monitors, um, with ten rings each. Alright, and let's bounce through here. Alright, pick up a barrier. Alright, wait for this to go down, and let's, gotta avoid these cylinders. There is a bat brain. 
Well, anyways, let's push this block here onto this switch here and move this, um, spike, um, thing up. And there we go. Get the checkpoint. Faster. Oh! Alright, you know, I'm just gonna go back here, pick up this monitor here. I mean, this barrier from the monitor. And let's hop on these blocks that are falling into this lava here. Alright. Um, not much to see. Alright, and yep, there's a... Alright, on to these blocks that move. Up here and up here and let's oh, jump too early. Alright, let's uh, be careful here. Yep. Right, and jump. Alright, you gotta avoid that fire stuff there. Alright. Ah! And we have access to bonus, another bonus stage here. All right, let's go on through. All right. All right. Oh, there, there's a chaos emerald. Oh. All right. oh. Trying to access the middle here. Let's, yep, got another continue. Good for us. Alright. Alright. Let's see. Okay, got, gotta avoid that. Oh, alright. Well, out on that chaos emerald but on the bright side we got another continue now on to act two marble zone all right Switch. Go down here. Take out that bat brain. And push this block here into uh, lava here. And it will basically act as a raft. Oh. Anyways. Uh... Oh. We had a barrier, but that bat brain took it out. Oh. Oh! Well, I wasn't careful enough, apparently. And we got a game over. Oh well, we have these two continue, so let's continue. Back to Marvel Zone Act 2. And apparently, that seal there is um, immune to lava. Alright. Let's 
let's go past here, avoid the lava flow and the fire stuff, and, um, let's push this box here, and, um... That's an awfully patient <laughs> lava flow we have there. Anyways, let's now outrun it. And avoid spikes there. Okay, nope. through get on this swinging platform this one all right now let's see and um now let's run through and do a spin dash that basically takes out enemies for us which we'll need with those caterpillars as their only weak spot is their head Anyways, let's hop on this block here. There's some lava geysers. Alright, I'm gonna drop down on here. Alright, and wait for this block. Alright, and... Well, I could jump on that platform, however... There's a secret area here, which contain not only contains two ten ring monitors, but also an extra life. All right, and now let's get on this block here, which will take us back, or not? Whoop! There we go. Anyways, let's go through this routine again. Here, which you should probably do considering how there's a checkpoint. There's a 10 ring um, monitor, which will give you 10 rings, which will probably need some protection in this area. Now initiate the what what, what what happened? I have no idea what happened, um I was like invincible and then I died. by buzz bombers here. Wait, oh, gotta be careful here. Alright. Alright. Down through here. Alright, take out the caterpillar. 
wait for that thing to drop down. Okay. Now let's continue on through as normal. Alright. And... Here's the end guild. Full post. And... Now, on to... Act 3. Let's get back to work. Oh. And here's a secret clove here. Gotta be careful of that spike stuff here. Oh. Alright. Cross that stuff here. Avoid this glass cylinder here and so Alright, through some blocks. And um Alright. Anyways, I should point out that that's actually an alternate path. Um There's another there's a more harder path. Anyways, um, let's continue riding this lava here, and uh, let's end up here, jump over here, alright, alright, right, take out that, ah, good, yeah, basically this, I should point out that last process is, um, Very it's a um kind of an obnoxious process to go through, um especially if you don't fail it properly, because basically if you fail that routine, um you bet ba you're basically gonna lose a life. Cross from here. Oh. Right, take out that caterpillar. Alright. And we got a berry here, which will probably help us out. Alright. Wait for the cylinder. Oh, yeah. Also, I should point out that if you push up on the control pad, Sonic will look up and screen will change. And same if you look down. Alright. Out through here. Jump in here. Get on this block here. And let's continue on. Stair spikes. There's a rings there. Jump over that caterpillar. And let's push this block into lava. And here we are going to be encountering what is probably one of the most frustrating parts of this act. Well, not here at the moment, but you'll see when we get to it. Alright. Oh. Gotta be careful here. Get this box for ten rings. Avoid some fire. And some spikes. 
Alright, we're going down here. Alright. Oh! Yeah, this is what I'm talking about. Basically, you have to do this platforming well enough, or else you fall down and you basically have to go through that area again. I mean, we could probably... We can jump across, but basically with that floating rock thing, it makes it easy. It's okay to stand on spikes, just not in front of spike. Sorry. Or on. Well, like, uh, not the pointy. The pointy part's the part you don't want to touch. Anyways, let's go down here. Alright. here, jump here, jump. Ooh, that's close. Alright. Jump here. Jump here. Jump here. Alright. We made it. And that's the hard part. Oh! And here's a goalpost here. Yeah, this. Oh! Yeah, this is one of the more longer teasers. And it's time for a rematch with Dr. Robotnik. Instead of a wrecking ball, he has brought along a um fireball gun thing. It's a relatively simple boss. And he's dead. Alright, off we go. Break open this capsule. And we have finished Marble Zone Act 3. On a side note, I should probably point out that. Well. I should probably point out that this is actually the end of this um, segment for the Let's Play. And next time, I will see you all at... Um, all right, I'll see you all next time where I go through the next two zones, which will be sp the Spring Yard Zone and the Labyrinth Zone. This is G-Mainer here saying, see you all next time. Thank you and good night.